we explain how third-party accreditation will assure your food is safe. Meet Angie, manager of a grocery store and a mother of three. Every day she supervises a team of food handlers and buyers, accepts deliveries, and helps customers. However, she recently heard a favorite snack is impacted by a foodborne illness outbreak. Angie is worried. What about the safety of her customers and her own family? And how will this issue impact business at her store? How can she be confident that the food she sells is safe? Tim is an assessor from the American National Standards Institute, or ANSI, the national standards body of the United States, coordinating private sector standards and conformance activities. He offers to explain food safety certification and the role of ANSI accreditation in the process. Tim explains that there are many layers to food safety, like an onion. And as you go, each layer adds another dimension of confidence, credibility, and safety to the whole process. At the center of the onion is the food itself. The first layer of protection comes from the producers of the food. They are responsible for assuring that their farm, manufacturing facility, suppliers, and distribution systems are safe. Next is the certifier, also called audit company. This layer evaluates and then certifies the producer's food safety processes, systems, and operations to established food safety standards. The last layer is the accreditation body. They review the procedures, processes, and qualifications of the certifier's personnel. They assess whether or not all the procedures are being followed and whether or not personnel are competent to provide a food safety certification. Basically, they check the checkers. The accreditation body doesn't touch the food, the farmer, manufacturer, or supplier. They assess the certifier to assure that their practices conform to specified food safety requirements, that they have competent personnel, and that they operate with transparency and with impartiality. Tim adds that Angie probably wouldn't buy an onion without that outer coating of protection. Similarly, accreditation provides a layer of confidence in the entire system, from the farm to the fork. Although certifiers or audit companies aren't necessarily required to get accredited, having third-party accreditation offers many benefits. For starters, more and more government agencies, companies, and international entities rely on accreditors, like ANSI, to assure consistency and integrity of certification bodies and the food safety certifications they issue. Together, they create a system of trust and reduce risk by assuring competent certifiers and guarding against conflicts of interest. Today, some government agencies that inspect food producers and food manufacturers are even starting to rely on accredited third-party certifications to help them assure the safety of the food supply chain. Relying on accreditation bodies and accredited certifiers creates a global safety net that helps us all assure the safety of food, from the farm to the restaurant and the grocery store. Thanks to Tim, Angie knows more about the food safety assurance process. Now, she looks to stock foods from the suppliers with accredited certification in food safety at the supermarket to add one more level of assurance to the safety of her customers and her children. Accredited food safety certification, an extra level of protection from the American National Standards Institute. <laughs>